We worked in restaurants and bars for a long time, and you, you know that when it's, it's done right, your experience is enjoyable working there. You know, for every decision that you make, like aesthetically, then also has to work, you know, like within this like engine that is the restaurant. How many steps does this server or bartender or bar back have to make before it comes back out? Context is really more important than the initial idea. You know, as, as it changes, as the space changes, you have certain, you know, like constraints and it's just about like creating that thread and ma making sure that that narrative is, you know, exists. We had worked basically growing up for our dad, mm -hmm. um, just, you know, like working on construction sites, doing a bunch of different kinds of like residential building. Bike jumps. Yeah. Um, tree forts, we had that one in the crab apple tree. The first restaurant. The restaurant was Manhattan Inn. Yeah. yeah. Um, the first establishment was Elsa, was the bar. We've had a lot of ideas that we were like really in love with. Yeah. And then when we either went to start them or and they just were like, it's not going to work. Ah, uh, oh, The staircase at Poly G's. Yeah. We really had this dream of creating it's very like intricate, like very elaborate staircase that kind of like went up to that um, that little catwalk there. Um, but you know, like, due to you know like some some like constraints, we weren't able to actually put the staircase in. Didn't really make sense overall. Um, I think that over time we just kind of you know whenever we find something you know interesting, we grab it and hold on to it and hopes to use it in a future project. Yeah, I mean the, the darker wood up there is uh, from an old port or wine barrel and a lot of which that wood went into poly G's. Cuts. Cuts and bruises and scrapes, yeah. Yeah, there, there's usually bloodshed, yeah. but um, it's nothing, it's never anything. Yeah. yeah.